Hello! Hello, 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 hello. What's going on in this joint? How are you all doing? And welcome to the stream. This is totally not correct grammatical sentence stuff, but it'll have to do. <laughs> so, welcome, welcome, welcome to this live stream. To this chaos live stream. To this multiplayer live stream. You can already see a little bit of text at the top. Don't worry about it not being in the middle. It will make sense once I load up the park. <laughs> then it will be in the middle of something else. I love chaos. Yeah, so do I. Well, sometimes I do. You know, it's funny. I was just wondering when you might do another multiplayer stream. Well... Tonight, the night. Tonight, the night of everyone's fantasies coming through or whatever. Um, you know, let's just get into it. So, I'm gonna make a server. You need to be on the latest development version. Um, which, if you have the launcher, you should have it. It's also that one. Which I just linked. It would be really unfortunate if they literally five minutes ago put out a new one. But that chance is quite small. Um, if they do, <laughs> you need to be on 980 E3CB. In which case, uh, that's the one you need. But most likely that will still be the latest. It was the latest 15 minutes ago. So the password will be Vos Marcel. Just so that, you know, no random people can join or whatever. My Wi-Fi is out to sacrifice any guests to the Elder Gods as an offering. I will. So, I'm gonna load up a game that I've prepared. It's gonna take a while. And you should be able, if you're on the right version, you should be able to see the server now. And join. And... I didn't actually check any of the roles. They should be the same still. Like builder... Oh, there we go. Welcome slime. Yeah, all this stuff is good. Yeah, that seems fine. There we have Brox. Oh, and people are already disconnecting. I don't know if that... A, it immediately crashed. Is that because I just have a... Crap ton of stuff? Like, is it because I have too many rides? Like, if I don't group... I have literally everything selected. Could that be the issue? That I have too much thing... Too many things selected. Hmm. Didn't actually try it out. I tried out that people could see it, but... Didn't actually try it out with people joining it. Okay, uh... Quickly. Maybe it's the expansion stuff. You mean the... Oh, oh, Wacky Worlds and Time Twister stuff. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna quit to menu then. Um, and I'm going to load up. And quickly put that all away. You do have the hybrid, right? Prox and the zero G roll. That is that. That's not causing any issues, right? So uh, select it only. Then we're gonna remove uh, move everything else. Okay, that all works. All right, let's remove everything from the expansions. And that's why I should test this stuff. Oh well, it'll be fine. This is a lot of coasters from the expansions. And they're all reskins. I mean, some of them look really cool. Don't get me wrong. But, you know, it's a little bit lazy. One could say. And nothing there, nothing there, nothing there. Okay, let's see. Oh, wait, there is some custom stuff in there. Oh, right, that's stuff I always have selected. Uh, just in case, let's... Okay, there we go. Let's disable that as well. Yeah, this seems all be fine. 
All the expansion stuff is gone. Okay, save. Hope it works. Yes. Okay, start server. Maybe 50 is still a higher limit. Maybe that's a problem as well. Well, let's see. Load game. All right. Try again. Let's hope it works this time. At least you could join. It didn't... At least that works. Because, like, a while ago I had a lot of problems with that. Uh... Bro? No. 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 Problems are still there. Crashing again. Could it be because I... No, that can't be, right? Because this was a smaller park and then I just... I made the land a little bigger. You posted the crash matches in Discord. Let me have a quick look. Um... Okay, that seems like just a standard crash, mas crash message, which I can't do anything with. Okay, so what could be the problem? I don't have any custom stuff anymore. Uh, oh, this is the classic mini coaster. I do have the panda stuff, so RST1 stuff. Brox is checking the crash. It's of course the one time like I've tried done this before and of course this happens. It might just be a bug in the multiplayer. I don't know. Maybe that's just like a really recent new bug. So okay, let me just quickly check something. Will I be able to build zero G rolls? Okay, that's fine. Oh, yeah, I'll, I'll quickly drown the guest carry. Hang on. I can do that at least, because it doesn't crash from me, which makes sense. Yeah, don't try to join right now. It will just crash. Uh, that won't suddenly be fixed. Is it the same scenario? It's just my test park, but made bigger. Like, I used sandbox to make it bigger, but like... Or is it because I have plugins? Oh... Would it be the plugins? Yeah. Oh, just before I saw your message, Brox, I discovered that that might be... Uh, or I discovered... I, I was like, yeah, that might be the problem. Uh, okay, let me remove my... I think I would need to restart... Okay, called plugins. And I'll restart the... Let me quickly check. Are they there still? No, they're not. Okay, so I don't need to restart the game. What just happened? Oh well. Start server! Vos Marcel. Uh, load the game. Attempt number three. Let's see. Does it work this time? I... I th you know what? This might have been a problem last time as well, but I would have completely forgotten. It works! Okay, go ham! Like, do... Do some random stuff. Build whatever. We have a 500 by 500 map. I'll enable all the cheats we'll need. Just... Have fun. Oh, and by the way, you see the stuff at the top? That's now exa exactly in the middle of the buttons. Wait, permission denied? Are you all not... Oh, default group is bloody spectator. Uh, I'll make you all builder. Anyone who joins now should be builder. Okay, that's fine. Let's see. Why, did default, why is default group spectator? Oh, I know why. Because the last multiplayer thing I did was with my brother. And there we had people spectating. And I just forgot to check that because I assumed it would still be the same as my last multiplayer. You can read the top right. I mean, this is fine. This is fine. <laughs> this is like on the very edge of keep it vaguely family friendly. 
Like, I built this when... I, something like this when I did multiplayer stream with my brother, so it's fine. But, you know, that that's about on the edge of what's fine. <laughs> well, thank you very much, Brox, for... Uh, solving that problem. Is this stable or nightly? Uh, this is development version. It is... Uh, exclamation mark version uh, there we go that one spectators also the default group with no perms yeah but I usually have building as the default group and I forgot I changed it oh what's this is that fire trap it's glowing embers what does fire trap look like um oh it's not even red you know what I absolutely love? All the pre-builds of the wooden coaster. Like, there are so many. Not even the U ones. There's a roller coaster second one and often not that great. But there are so many in Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. It's lovely. And they're all good. Like, every single one is good. I mean, this one's... Well, it's either good or it's a real coaster. Like, Judge Roy Scream isn't good, but it's a real coaster, so that's fine. Thank you for the sub, Karma OW. Did I say thank you for the gifted subs line? Well, anyway, there you go. Why? Like, this looks like support from Glowing Ember. But why are they there? Hang on, what's the path doing? I have a feeling there's some kind of glitch going on. Huh. When placing uh, default roller coasters. Or uh, safe designs. Yeah, look at this. This is the scenery inside the scenery. Inside the coaster. There seems to be some kind of glitch going on. Thank you for the sub. Manuk Made. Okay, so what do we have? We have a very long queue line on this. Okay, just to get a little bit of stuff going on. There we go. Let me hire some staffs. You know what? Just in case I need it later. Let me fire the auto clicker. Ah, that's better. And some entertainers. Much better. Oh, thank you for the two gifted subs. Karma LW. I do appreciate that. Ah. Good old go-karts. Hey, that's a lot of go-karts. For such a tiny track. That's 12 of them. That makes sense. Because that's the default, I believe, for... Having disabled vehicle limits. Now, I want you to drown, please. Thank you. I like drowning people. Do you? Would you believe that? So, I know there was a plot of the Roller Coaster Tycoon and Friends Discord server to build a wall and fire roller coasters to the other side of it. Ooh, there's lots of stuff going on already. So I wonder if they're actually going to do that. Um, I know Brox was in on it, uh, Charles, but he doesn't have he didn't have Open RST2 installed, so maybe he'll still install it and get here later. Oh, look at that! We got a single real coaster. Uh, I think the single real coaster looks really weird. Not this design, but just the coaster in general. I mean, I mean X7 did a great job on it, as you'll hear me say tomorrow, but. It just, because, you know, it's not his fault that it looks weird. It's just a real-life roller coaster. But it's, I think it just looks odd. It's it's very cool, though. And we have the medium corkscrews. So I see a lot of people being disconnected. Hmm. Is that, is there anything we could do about that? Or is that their own fault for, I don't know, trying crazy stuff? Or... Feels odd because it's not from the original game. But the hybrid coaster doesn't feel odd to me at all. Well, thank you for the gifted sub, Benzoya. And the 100 bits a little bit earlier. 
Like, the hybrid coaster is perfectly fine for me. Where is it? There it is. Game was lagging so bad. Is there, is there a place with lots of lag? <laughs> it's fine for me. But like, a hybrid coaster is really cool by the way. You know, launch lift hill, which I just adore. I think the launch lift hill is one of the best things in the game. And uh, then we do a zero G roll. Yeah, lovely. Absolutely lovely. And I'll do like that. And I'll go like that. And then we'll do another zero G roll, but this time a small one. Oh, thank you for another 200 bits, Benzoya. And thank you for the follow his buff and techno hornist. You know, I think this looks lovely. It's one of my favorite coaster. No, I don't know if the coaster type itself is one of my favorites, but I really like the way it looks. So that would be one of my favorites. Uh, yeah, you know what? Let's do a 12 car train on this. I do think the flat track on land looks a bit weird. You know, the station platform is a bit high up. But other than that, it looks fun. Clearance checks are disabled, can't change it back. Wait, can't change what back? What's wrong? Can any of us join multiplayer? Look at the top of the screen. Anyone can join. As long as you have the latest development version. Well, we'll probably get some decent stats on this. One of the cheats is enabled. And we don't have cheat perms. I mean, yeah, I enabled the cheat. I enabled... Uh, like, I can... I, I Only I can do this. I can disable, disable clearance checks. But... Do you want me to? Because you, usually, you know... It's nice when it's turned off. Do you need it turned off for anything? Thank you for some more bits, Benzoya. Disable clearance checks. Clearance checks are disabled. Leaving it on a lot can break things sometimes. That's fair enough. What's the latest version? You know what? I'll turn it off for now. Or now nah, we'll keep it on. It's the latest development version. It's that one. We have a command for that. Although, I wouldn't fault you for not knowing that, because we rarely ever use it. You mean disabling the disabling clearance check? Alright, fair enough. This is interesting. Uh, <laughs> a 3D cinema inside a helix. I don't... Th and that would fit normally. I always prefer using the tile inspector over disabled clearance check. Yeah, but lots of people don't really know the tile inspector. Although, you know what? I'm going to keep it off for a little bit. Because I don't see it being used all too much anyway. And yeah, it will screw things up. So a better connectivity might be preferable. Now, so far we've focused a lot on this area. Which is logical because it's near the entrance. Uh, by the way, I want the park rating. Thank you very much. And let's see what's going on. Oh, someone is... Building a mountain here. This might be building... This might be just random stuff. Or this might be the start of a proper mountain. Marshall, I'm just watching the most recent Thunder Rock stream. Nice to see you using the hybrid coaster in it with a single reel. Watching my phone at the moment, so the text is really small. Yeah, I, I'm enjoying using the new coaster types. Okay, so yeah, so yeah, we have a monorail here. And I had to look at that. There are some big mountains here. There's some deserty stuff here. With a very long... Is it me? Or is in every multiplayer stream I do, is there someone who is just building some desert theme? It might It might be the same person every time. 10.39 excitement. Well, at the moment it doesn't have any excitement. Ooh, that's a very tall hill. 
Let's see, there we have a little coaster in the snow, a single rail coaster. Look at that, this is a medium corkscrew. It's bigger than a small corkscrew. Uh, wait, a large corkscrew, never mind. Bigger than a small corkscrew, which, duh. <laughs> and it's very cool. This looks wonderful, this drop. Look at that. Wait, hang on. Is this a large... I thought this didn't have access to large uh, level 2 steep pieces. Or is it only because I have to enable all drawable track pieces? Because I thought this one had small. Because when I built with it, it had access to small level 2 steep pieces. Interestingly enough. Huh. I think we're gonna follow. I'm Legos, Tyler Gotchi, and Murrayzer. But yeah, this drop looks wonderfully smooth into the corkscrew. The hybrid coaster has a bit of a chain lift on the way down the first zero G roll. That's not intentional. Uh, does it? It does. <laughs> it has chain lift. Oh, it has chain lift everywhere. Everywhere. It, it has chain lift everywhere. It's just only that it can only render there. It has chain lift on the way up as well. I accidentally had chain lift enabled everywhere because th that cheat is on. Um, so that people can use chain lift everywhere if they want. Like, if I, for example, make this chain lift ridiculously fast, then as you can see, it will continue speeding up. <laughs> and why not make it do 12 laps? Because. That's fun. <laughs> Alright, let's give it a little bit more fantastical colors. Um, we'll make this purple and... Oh. Yellow. Hell yellow. Uh, this is good speed. <laughs> oh, the desert is already here? Or is this a different desert? Oh, that's a different desert. Well, it's more like a beach. Oh, I like this very realistic water here. This is totally... I mean, these kind of cliff-like things do exist in real life, but... <laughs> Looks a bit Minecrafty. Oh, someone has claimed something here. And... There's a go-kart here. This, with, this is... Pos was this pre-built, pre-saved? Because this looks like a lot of work to already have done. Painting all these individual pieces. Red and white. It's, I like it though. It's called Goat Cards 1. So maybe it wasn't. How big is the park? 500 by 500. Nope. Custom built. Oh, it's Bruxis. Well, it looks nice. Ooh. and Now, what I like is... We have, you know, some random weird coaster here. Which is not meant to be any... In any way realistic. Looks funny, but it's not realistic. And then we have something that's way more realistic right here. I mean, not entirely. This wouldn't be in real life, so such a turn like that. But you know, nice mountain. Nice coaster. Uh whoever is building this looks nice. Continue. And then we have this totally realistic. <laughs> I have a sip of water. Ooh. And. Ooh. What's this? A path? Looks like someone is building a forest slash garden here. Also, can I turn off the beeps that this makes? Just those beeps. Let me see. Can I. Oh, that's a crash. Try not to crash your right. Because that gives a pop for everyone. Um, let's see. Can anyone join? Yes. Should be able to find the server name and the passwords at the top of the screen. Um, I don't think I can turn that off. So we're going to have to live with those beeps. Uh, but they're not too loud, so, yeah, it should be fine. <laughs> I like this. 
Just a very long way to a toilet. Hotel California. You can never leave. And we have a nice coaster here. So Piss Creator says someone make Bench Guy and Bench Girl. You could join and do it yourself. Or someone could do it. Thank you for the sub by the way. SVO Fanatic. I think it's a slime toilet. Yeah, that makes sense. We also have Mr. Bones here. My vertical coaster with horrid drop break. Why is it a horrid drop break? It looks fairly normal to me. Also, you also seem to have chain lift everywhere. <laughs> And what do we have here? That looks weird for a wild mice coaster. Like, this is not what wild mouse coasters should look like. It's interesting, because it's new. I think there's a bug that always places chains on all pieces. Is it a bug? Let's see. Uh, doesn't seem to be. If I, you know. It doesn't seem to be a bug. You can turn it off, but the cheat is on, so that if you want them on unconv in unconventional places, you can. And it will be fun. Also, uh, what's the highest island in the world? That was a geography question that was asked. You mean, like, presumably the highest mountain on an island. I'm gonna say New Guinea. Um, you know, if you mean the highest island in the world in terms of wheat, it's probably Jamaica. Um, you know, stereotypical joke. But I think New Guinea will have the highest mountain of, like, four point something kilometers. I'm not sure, though. We have a nice giga coaster here. Which I like the color scheme of actually. These colors work together very well. The layout is nothing too special, but you know, it's a neat layout. Thanks for latest link. I'm happy with the new hybrid. Yeah, usually I would go on the latest table, on the latest release version, but I wanted people to have be able to play with the zero G rolls and stuff. Oh, this is nice. You know, I'm a sucker for this kind of rustic style. And presumably this will still be changed to a proper land thing at some point. Considering the way the other stuff is going. And you know, it's such a sign in an orchard like this. Is it orchard or orchard? Well, whatever. In a tree farm. Or tree grid. <laughs> Looks nice. Same with this sign. Dingleberry acres. Sweet. The blue and yellow elevator is killing people. Oh yeah, I should turn off notifi should turn on notifications for that. Uh, there we go. Now we'll be able to see notifications for people dying. I had those turned off because for the video for Thursday. Is it, is it letting people in? Hang on, where's the exit? Uh, uh, I just need to three see through scene. Oh, uh, the exit's invisible. It's one of these, and then they're falling into the water, I suppose. It looks neat, though. I like the scenery around it. Looks very neat. Let's see, is it actually killing people? New Guinea has the highest mountain from the seabed. Eurasia has the house, highest mountain overall. Eura Eurasia isn't an island. You know, when we talk about islands... Oh, there was no one on it, and I can't check. Um... Eurasia is not an island. When we talk about islands, is anything Greenland or smaller? How can I join that map? Go to multiplayer. It's it's the you know you have those four big buttons on the bottom uh, on your home screen. It's the second one from the right, the one with the globe, and uh, then the multiplayer server name and the password are at the top of the screen. Pyramid by the sea. I mean, the pyramids of Giza aren't that far from the sea. Like, they're not on the sea, but like, I don't know, 100 kilometers? Maybe 150? It's somewhat close. Now, Australia is not smaller than Greenland. 
Australia is much, much larger than Greenland. I like this Goliath sign just for the merry-go-round. <laughs> also, oh, I, hang on, I can't force a breakdown. Is, is that not a thing in multiplayer? That, that's interesting. Huh, I didn't know that. I wanted it obviously to have, uh, you know, the, for the music to speed up. But apparently, you can't do that in multiplayer. You can't force a breakdown. We have a neat garden here. I like this. Whoever built this, good job. It's nothing special, but it's neat. You know, it's fences, and fences are fabulous. There's a coaster with a corner in the lift in real life. Twister at Knubbels. Oh, that's interesting. I know there's also a coaster. I believe it might be Wickerman and Alton Towers. Which has a chain lift. I mean, it's a wooden coaster. But it has a chain lift that goes something like this. With, with like the, the steep chain lift bit. And it changes slope. After a little bit. We can't use the scenery brush. Huh. I can. <laughs> Is that something I have to allow builder? Can I allow builders to use that? Thank you for the follow, by the way. Paper baboon. Let's see. Park properties, funding. Cheat. It doesn't seem like there's an option for that. So... I don't know what I can do for you. And Raven just crashed. What's the password? It's at the top of the screen. It's not supposed to be hard to get on here. Hey, Cody just joined. Is that the Cody? Or is that someone else called Cody? Who knows? This is a nice wooden coaster. And once again, nice color scheme. This will work exceptionally well. For like a Sea World themed wooden coaster or something like that. Are you running on develop? Yes, I am. Exclamation mark version. Just the latest develop. It might not work if you respond to someone, Xak. The Nightbot might not pick up the command then. See what kind of queue lines Cody makes. I mean, then this should also have been made by Cody. Poor guests. Oh, satisfaction is unknown. You know what's interesting? Um, two days ago, someone on Reddit asked how does satisfaction work? Why does my coaster only have 45% satisfaction? And then someone copy-pasted the info from the Rollercoaster Tycoon wiki. And I was like, it had something about it's the percentage of people that have ridden the ride more than once. And that, like, whether people will ride it again, that's these kind of factors. And I was like, wait a minute, that sounds wrong. I didn't know exactly why, but there was just some stuff in it that sounded wrong to me. So I looked it up in the code. Okay. I'm gonna delete that ride. Because of the name. We have one of those people. Whoever is doing something like that. Uh, I don't think I can find out who, who did that. But don't do that. Thank you very much. Anyway. Moving on. I had a look at the code. You can check server logs if you want to find out. Can I? I thought last time... Oh, I don't log user actions. Well, I will now. That's why I couldn't find it last time. Because I hadn't, I hadn't turned it on. Well, if it happens again, we'll see it. Anyway. Um, is there anything else that I need to check out? I had to look at the code. And I was right that it was wrong. Because um, the satisfaction is dependent on how long guests have waited. How much they have paid. And whether if they've paid too much. Which is dependent on their happiness. You know, the happier they are, the more they want to pay. Um, 
and whether they've already gone on the ride or a ride of similar type. Both give a little bonus. And I couldn't make sense of all the exact numbers. Um, you know, I need to ask Dirklink for that. And when, when, when I at some point I'll make a video about it, or someone else at least to explain it to me. Um, but I could at least get a general sense and that the wiki was wrong. And I'm happy I was there quite quickly. I saw the post like less than an hour after it was posted, so the reply quoting the wiki was even less old. Because it corrected misinformation. And the wiki is... On that stuff, I wouldn't trust it. Let's just say that. Oh, this is neat. Someone deleted my stuff. Uh, it might have been me. Because there was a free fall with a very offensive name. Which popped up. It crashed. And I immediately deleted it. Um, if someone else renamed it. Then that might have been yours. Apologies if it is. But you'll have to rebuild it. Okay, what do we have? We have some more pyramids here. This is a... Do we have the stats for this ride already? 9.68 excitement. The name of this ride isn't accurate. It's not true. Did someone rename the Teal and Orange Freefall? Yes, they probably did. I don't remember the colors. Didn't really look at the colors, but yep. Oh, wasn't wasn't that somewhere here? It was like, oh yeah, it was it, it was this one. Well, someone renamed it, and I deleted it. Let's see. Let's just check in. Okay, it seems to be nothing at the moment. Okay, looks like this isn't going to be an, a real mountain after all. It's going to be, well, whatever it is now. How, what would you call this? Like, just different platforms? This look interesting. And, whoa, that's a hell of an element. Look at this. Goes up. And then there's a bat wing? Is that a bat wing? Or is it a bat wing when you exit the other way? Instead of the way back. I forget. Do we have stats? Well, those are neat stats. Plateau. Yeah, multiple plateaus. Double up Cobra roll, double down. Oh, it's a Cobra roll, of course. Do we have stats on this? Oh, yay, that bug. Multiplayer is still a bit glitchy sometimes, where you randomly just... Like... You start building someone else's coaster that someone else is building. Yeah, it looks like that's happening with this one at the moment. Uh, I'm not doing any of this. Nice. <laughs> anyway, let's look at the stats of this thing. 44 intensity. Sweet. Ooh, 11.11 .11 lateral Gs. That was unintentional, but nice. Also, why is there someone named after uh, Open RCT2 built in the chat? <laughs> I've never seen that before. Batwing starts and ends with the corkscrews and has the half loops in the middle. Hey. Wait, what? Hang on. Starts and ends with the corkscrews and has the... Did Marshall just delete my heart line? No, I didn't. No, I didn't do anything. I wasn't doing any of that. Hang on, so wait, this doesn't have corkscrews. Uh, let me get a thing with corkscrews. There we go. Oh, of course, I couldn't visualize it, but now I can. Uh, half loop. Yeah, it's like this. Half loop. This is a bat wing. Uh, a corkscrew. But, no, corkscrew. But this is, this should be a bat wing then. But what's this? What's this called? When you go the other way. That has a name too, presumably. But what's it called? Also, someone crashed their wooden coaster. Butterfly loop. Ah, cool. I like that name. 
Oh, no, let's just entirely delete it. Here we have a disconnected junior coaster. It's a dueling junior coaster. Well, it's a Mobius. And for some reason, the entrance and the exits aren't connected. <laughs> well, they'll connect them at some point if they want it to work. <laughs> and here we have... Ooh, that's, a, that's nice. We have a chain lift that goes through a zero G roll. That's neat. Sorry for asking noob questions. Yeah, you're on the wrong version. You need to be on that version of OpenRCT2. Go install it and you will be able to join. Ooh, we have a wooden coast here. Was that the one that just crashed? I like this out and back. I like when it like syncs up with itself the track for a little bit here. That's neat. That my one, the junior is mine and the game lags when I try to edit it. Wait, hang on. Okay, so I presume the hybrid is Jarsnels and the junior is Petrolimas. Let's see, what's going on here? Do I recognize this? The great Duval screen machine. Okay, so I know so this is not a pre-build. It's this is like almost one of the default color schemes. But I believe in the default color scheme is this one instead of the brighter one. Huh. It it it's interesting because it looks just ever so slightly off. Also, that's a lot of disconnect. What's going on? Who has done something that does all the disconnects? Oh, thank you. Uh, whoever's building this. Marcel is the best. Thank you very much. Game is just very buggy. I presume it is, yeah. Me probably. What are you doing, that guy? What a, what a wild experiment are you performing? They built the launch three volt just just crashed. Wait, which launch three volt just crashed? I I didn't get a launch three volt that just crashed, but oh well. We have a little train here now. Trying to find an idea to contribute in this server, but instead I get these things. Okay, little thing. You don't need... If you get just desynced, you don't need to reconnect. You can still build if you're desynced. Like, if you get disconnected, yeah, then you need to reconnect, obviously. But if you're desynced, you can still keep building. Just that some things like staff movements or whatever might not line up. But you can still, like, build a ride or build scenery. Will still work. So we got some more guests. Let me build a little thing. It's good to not wait too long with reconnecting after a desync. Yeah, fair enough. Okay, what to build? What to build? I have an idea. Something that's always fun. We'll build this. And then we're going that way. And going this way. No, not 10 plus excitement. Well, maybe actually. I mean, cheats are on. So I'm going to use some cheats to uh, do some random fun stuff. And just see what happens. I don't know what exactly I'm going to do yet. But there's a whole lot of different uh, ride vehicles to choose from. So let's see. Alrighty. Okay, which one will look funny? Now, obviously, we need to have a very high launch speed. So let's get that up to the highest possible. There we go. Uh, let's get this to like... Uh, 
Uh, uh, let's do 80. And one train. Let's try... <laughs> Jet skis. Uh... <laughs> Whatever that will do. Wait, did it? Oh, I can't open it. Multiplayer bugs! Woo! Hell yeah! Fantastic! Techno stop- is Techno... ...messing with other people's rights? Can anyone confirm that? But yeah, please don't do that. Oh, it's randomly sending me to build rides. Yeah, that happens. Is me trying to put this into test mode messing up things for others as well? Huh. Well, I suppose I can't test it now. Ooh, this makes a lovely sound. Simultaneous chain lifts. Can I just open it instead? No, that also won't work. What if I do construction, redo it? Nope. Still not. I can't save the design and rebuild. Okay, you know what? Let's just delete it entirely and try again. Yes, very mature. Okay, this time we're not going to use banked turns. Because who needs banked turns, am I right? Oh, we just got a lot of people dead. <laughs> cool, a rocket ship. Wasn't it like Jeff Bezos who had a rocket ship that looked uh, slightly more phallic than usual? Violently murder guest 6666 or whoever is closest. Why violently though? Like, why this desire for violence? Did I just get a message that I couldn't build because my own coaster was in the way? Even though it wasn't. Let's see, can I... Okay, I can test it now. I'll, I'll, I'll do guess 666 later. Although, presumably, by this time, someone has already killed them. I, I probably won't be in time. Let's see. That's nine. Uh, this will go to uh, 80. This will go to zero. This will be jet skis. Wait a minute. Ha. Huh. They're not, they're not starting in the station. Like, what? Oh, now they are. Oh, they just stopped there. Well, jet skis ain't working. Hey, who's recoloring my ride? <laughs> Let's try. What shall we try? Oh, panda trains all look funny. Oh. Ooh, max speed. A thousand. Did it go up to a thousand? Oh, it because it went down, obviously, after it. Huh. Neat. Anyway, let's see if we can find guest 666 and drown them. Uh, no, we can't. We definitely can't. I can rename one 6666 for you. Violently murder. Well, I can drop them on the track of this coaster. I actually can't. I can drop them next to it. I mean, I can drop them into the water and then take them out. Drop them into the water again. Oh, lordy. Hang on. Are they... Oh, they're trapped. Oh, they're actually going to a path. They're not actually trapped. And they're going there and then they're escaping. <laughs> Neat. 
Okay, I spent some time building that. Let's see what's been built in the meantime in other places. Well, this has been built, which is a nice little pier. And we have a chain lift. Right there. Let's see. What do we have close to home? Close to the park entrance. Not much. Well, not much that's new anyway. Uh, uh, by the way, this thing can open. This one's getting slowly more finished. We have a hard line here. We have... Oh, this would be, was already a thing. Oh, this is nice. Some nice little fences. And little path coming along. And this thing also existed. Is this new? Was the station building already there? It's called the Great Duval. Well, I wonder who built that. Uh, but it's nice. I like it. You gotta be kidding me. Why do your multiplayer madness streams every th single time I'm away? This is the fourth one I'm missing in a row. Been looking forward to one literally a year and a half. I'm sorry. <laughs> I promise I'm not doing it on purpose. Let's see. But I will promise I'll try to do the next one. I'll try to remember to do the next one when you're available. Um, we got this neat little, like, 1920s kind of go-kart going on. It doesn't have the 1920s cars. But that might be a good thing because they tend to get stuck. Check Mommy's Revenge under the pyramid. Oh, whoops, I paused the game. My bad. Under the pyramid. Wait, that's not looking through scenery. That is. Oh! That's a phallic shaped maze. Or is that just me seeing things? I ran for s some for like 20 years and they never stuck. Well, I recently got a message from someone that they did get stuck, so... It depends on the layout, I suppose. I mean, yeah, I'm seeing things, because half the things in the park are phallic. Tanks, Marcel. Is that some kind of... Just statement, just... Tanks. I mean, I do, you know... Tanks are nice weapons of war, I suppose. I like the scenery you did here. It's neat. It, of course, has one of the best two trees in the game. Which is the pink tree. Which is the best one along with the yellow tree. Coaster crashes a lot. Yeah, apparently it does. Oh, we have a new coaster here. Someone continuously closing my rides. I had that bug as well, Plasma. It's a thing that happens. Uh, I couldn't open my ride. It's not someone doing it. It's a bug. We have a weird little wild mouse here. It's not your standard wild mouse layout. It has quite <laughs> a tall drop, so to speak. Okay, this one can be opened. Ooh, I closed it and someone else immediately opened it. Ooh, it has quite a lot of laterals, but other than that, the stats are mostly fine. We have a... Ooh, this nice little garden. Was there, wasn't this Plasma who was making this? <laughs> Suddenly, Pyramid! <laughs> nice. I don't like this garden. Ah, yes, it's yours. Good work, good work. With the little things here, you know, with the land and the, the stuff. It's neat. I thank you for the two months, 13. At least I think that's what your name is supposed to be. We have a nice little single rail coaster here. Ooh, thank you for the five gifted subs. That's also very much appreciated. They can't find my coaster, the guests. Well, the path layout isn't great. 
Honestly, this is a really neat single rail coaster layout. Who built this? Oh, you Arsenal did. Nice. Well done. It... I like it. It's definitely better than any of the ones featured in my video tomorrow. <laughs> oh, I did my best. I had to build a cust lot of custom ones, so the video took a long time to make. Oh, it was you. Why is it called... Oh, your name is Yars, I suppose. Well, two people can have similar names. My apologies. Uh, well done anyway. Oh my god, this is horrid. And in the meantime, I have to drink some water. This is... I mean, I appreciate the effort you went to to make this horrible, but it is horrible. It is well done, but it's also horrible. I much love your videos. Thank you. And then this one was already a thing. The transport ride is finished. Then we have another single rail coaster here, which is also neat. Oh, I like the shorter trains. Literally every single coaster, either a hybrid or a single rail in tomorrow's video, has the maximum train length possible. Because I'm a noob and I have no creativity and I only ever use the maximum train length possible on the rides. Well, almost only. Ooh, this uh, has also got some new developments. That's a lot of trains. How many trains does it have? Seven. And apparently it's been retested. Did it get some underground features or something? Well, I got some cliffs, definitely. But yeah, there's an underground bit here. So I think it was rebuilt for that. And that's why it needs to retest. Did something just explodes in the background. Yeah, yeah, stuff like that happens every now and then. Wiener. Made out of skulls. Very nice. Ooh, and we have the farm. Which is slowly expanding over here. Nice Virginia reel. And a pickup truck ride. And a nice barn. I love this rustic style. Who was making this again? I forgot. Then we have a sweet little dive coaster. It's just neat. And a launch coaster. Well, four launch coasters actually. Oh, and we have a wooden coaster going on here. Why did my ride get deleted? I'm trying to mess with the train designs. I didn't get to save it. I don't know. Sometimes bugs do happen. It might also be someone... Also, this is, uh, whoever's building this, you messed up. Isometric view struck again. Yeah, this stuff is very buggy. I mean, I appreciate how difficult it is to make multiplayer work um, on, the develop on the developer's end, but it would be neat if, it, uh, if these kind of bugs would happen less. I don't know how, much, how, how, how big of an ask that is. It might be too big of an ask. I don't know. Marshall is the best. Oh, thank you. I mean, Brox presumably will know the answer to that if that's feasible. Because he is one of the devs. What else do we have? Let's zoom out a little bit. I can't zoom out further than this. I can. If I do this. This is how much I can zoom out on my 1440p monitor. I only stream in 1080p, but this is a scaling factor of half. This is unplayable. I mean, technically it's playable, but I did see we got this. Jeff. Please zoom back in. I think that's all laggy when you zoom out. Right, really? Laggy for everyone. Huh, that's interesting. Jeff's terrible coaster. It's not the greatest coaster in the world. I'll, I'll agree on that. 
but in terms of sta no, never mind. <laughs> I thought it looked like all right, but now it's going a little bit too fast, and it's gone. Okay, we do have a nice little uh, tentacle uh, orgy here, which is neat. I like that. And we have a little, uh, what's it called, uh, a river rapid as well. I like tentacles. I'm not a particular fan of tentacles myself, but sometimes they're nice. I just realized I'm not in this room. I'm building a coaster in someone else's room, apparently. You mean on a different random server? Lol. My coaster isn't getting test results. Then there's some kind of coaster somewhere that's blocking them. Or it's just very slow. Ah, 66 in density. Huh, neat. Please drown Tim the Enchanter from Monty Python. Who is Tim the Enchanter? I'll rename a guest Tim the Enchanter. Is it the guy from the bridge with the questions? Crazy guy with the explosions? I don't know that guy. I only watched the Holy Grail. So if it's from Life of Brian or something else, I wouldn't know. He is from the Grail, okay. Is there anything... Oh, sorry, I shouldn't zoom out too much. Um, anything else that I missed? Well, we got a new build going on here. Ooh, this has developed some. This is a nice, more industrial, like, rusty... Like, this has a very strong feel, this color scheme. Like, it just... It just feels strong. Either be it, yeah, strong in the mountains, which it is here, or industrial... I like that. Check the corners of the map. Is it my face again? Y you always built my face, right? Let's see. Uh, well, not there. I've already done two corners. Oh, there we go. This is my face. Oh. Oh. There we go. <laughs> it seems like it's gone a little bit wrong on the left side. Because, you know, there's no map there. But... Yeah, you know, it's still accurate. It's pretty much my logo. That guy built it, built this in every uh, multiplayer session we do, if he's able to. So yeah, this is just a lot of wall pieces. And from the side, it looks like this. From the other side, it looks very cursed. And he just saved it with a twist, so he's able to build it anywhere. Like, if I select this, it's just this diagonal wall piece that's in the game. And they're all the exact same wall piece, just with different colors. And as a result, you get this. Because it rotated while placing. Oh, it wasn't supposed to be in this direction. See, did you already do anything in the other corner? No, it's already right there, right? Anything new here? Nope. Yeah, here there's already a right. This still hasn't been evolved. Brox, have you given up on this? And are you building on... Whatever other thing you're building on. This has changed colors. Also, I didn't color this this way. Someone else did. They broke the rules and colored one of my rides. But, you know, whatever. But they also just... Like... Why? Why is, like, one piece a different color scheme? Brox is helping me fill time. I'm paying him in Scooby Snacks. Okay, but what is he... I, I can just check, right? Uh, proxy here. Well. Oh. Okay. That's that's that guy's logo. Or, well, the guest face, I suppose. That's that guy's profile picture. Did you place this as well? I could just make him a spectator, just <laughs> to screw with him. <laughs> just randomly make people spectate and then like they wonder why they can't build. 
<laughs> Zoom to my cam. Let's see, where can I find you? There, here you go. Ah, so it is this thing. Well, now you can't build. Ha ha. <laughs> Sorry, I'll, I'll change you back. Uh, I shouldn't do that. that. That gives a lot of ping for everyone. Apparently. <laughs> like, the, the ping just went up. <laughs> I'm trying to make a very bad lake here. I don't see any lake quite yet. I assume this is going to be the lake. There is a river here. And you know, it is nicely taking shape. We got a little food court here. Which is neat. Although, from... Hang on, isn't this one... Looks like higher than the others? From not a single angle, you can actually see the fountain. You can only see the water. You can't see the statue that is fountaining the water. Because the trees are in the way. I like these coasters. They don't... I don't think they really fit in with the rest of the area. At the moment, at least. But I do like the idea. Hang on, did they just... Are they timed so well that they all have, like, the exact same length? Hang on, because these aren't the same, but do they still, like... Oh, that's timed wonderfully. That's, like, they're different, but they still have, like, the exact same length. That's amazing. That's incredibly well done. Like, they're gonna be slightly different with guests in them and whatever. And they're not, the, like, they're not 100% the exact same, but... Yeah, they're just in sync, but what I mean is that you've made these two different designs exactly... Probably gotta remove this... What? Where? Hang on. Apologies. Gotta zoom out for this. Or did someone else already remove it? Oh, it's gone now. Thank you very much. Um, I can probably see in the logs who did that. Uh, it was right, be oh, right behind the foreground. I didn't see it uh, for some reason. Someone just removed all the looping codes. Okay, where can I see who's doing that? There is a log somewhere here, right? Let's see. Well, I might want to change that. We have to delete right perms. Yeah, it's so that you can delete your own rights. Uh, uh, wait, hang on. Uh, can I... Where are the server logs? Oh, there it is. Server logs, Marshall multiplayer. That's a lot of server logs. Well, let's see. Oh my god. How am I ever gonna make sense of this? Okay, F hang on. For the time being, I'm going to remove the remove right thing. Because we have someone who's not playing nice. Which is not nice. I do not necessarily like you. But yeah, back to the server logs. How do I make sense of this? It was ugly and I removed it. Don't remove other people's rights. Just don't. Like, there's plenty of space in the park to, uh, 
Well, you know, I'll look at this some other time. I can't make sense of that. Oh, the swastika. Well, maybe at some point I'll be able to see who built the swastika and whatnot. Uh, for now, I don't know, let's just move on. We have a lake, which is good. Maybe it's Bergen all coasts of one type get deleted when one right gets deleted. Uh, hang on. Bye bye. Uh, well, this is the first time we've had a had a, had a troll like that. So, you know. Oh my god. Is there, like, can I... Can I ban certain words? In names? Probably not, that's not a feature that we have. So, I'm s sorry for this. I mean, I know it's not my fault, but... Ugh. This is very annoying. All I can do at the moment is just pay attention to this and keep immediately banning them. I can't IP ban, right? I don't think uh, that's a thing. I'm not sure. Maybe a mod could do it. If they don't want <laughs> someone to just... I mean... Just in case. You know, that guy you know is a mod. Now he's... Well, is he a mod on my server? Oh, he's a mod on my server. So I can make him an admin here. Um, that guy, you're an admin now. In case you need to do admin stuff and I don't see it. Uh, you can do it. But for the time, I have it, so you don't need to do anything. Max was here. Oh, someone named a ride after Max. That's neat. Where is it? Oh, it's the ghost train. It's obvious that that one crashed. Oh, lag. I just clicked on the ghost train and it lagged. So, uh, yeah, any kind of way to stop that from happening would be nice. I don't know how feasible it is once again, Brox and other devs. Free Bitcoin, really? I mean, at least the name isn't necessarily offensive. Whitelist. Yeah, the problem with whitelist is I want just everyone to be able to join. And maybe you can turn off turn off chat and text. By Twitch followers. <laughs> I mean, you're not even trying. We we can't even properly see the website. Like I can't even go there if I wanted to. What I, okay, what I am doing for now is I'm setting the default group to spectator. So that at least they can't destroy anything. Well, leading rights was already uh, was already removed. But yeah, I don't think there's any way for me. Correct me if I'm wrong, Brox, and others well, who might know it, to stop those people from joining. <laughs> What's this for name? 227 Sydney Saint Twin Falls ID. You know, as long as they, they're not chatting. 
I'm not gonna kick them. If they don't do anything, then. <laughs> okay, they're chatting. Loggenheimer, I'll make you a builder. <sighs> well. Uh, please do prevent your ghost train from crashing. Whoever is building this. It was a bit suspect since it was an address. I suppose... Max asked me to make it crash. Yeah, but it's a bit... You know, crashing right in Hultberry, everyone gets a pop-up. So... Try to do that as little as possible. Yeah, it's Max's fault. Everything's Max's fault. Well, not the spammer, of course, but... This is the first... Well, not the first time I've had to deal with something like this in general. But on the multiplayer streams, it has been. And obviously, because it's not a whitelist, it does make sense that it happens at some point. But so far it hadn't happened yet. There was the guy who was spamming my Discord server, uh, like start of the year, like seven, eight months ago. We have a log flume here now, which is neat. And some other right. Hide the P word. Yeah, but, like, they already know the password. I can't change the password. If I could change the password, I would have. Okay, that's not them, by the way. They're not on the server at the moment. Maybe IP ban. I can't IP ban. I think someone just guessed the password. Oh, that might be it. Let's see. Save game. Um, I don't know. 21. I'll just timestamp it. Let's see if this works. Uh, sorry for the sudden disconnect. I'm going to change the password. I'll make the password something completely random. Um, I'll make it... Nijmegen Centraal Station, or CS. Uh, load game. And I'll put it at the top. Let's see. Um, did he press down save? I mean, I saved it moments beforehand. Okay, there you go. Oh, is, is everyone now a spectator? Oh no, they're still builders. Good. Some new people are... Hang on, can I not make them... Oh, I can. It was just obscured. I'll figure out all this stuff. Wait, so many new people joining. That's that's interesting. Why are there why didn't you guys not join before? There was still space. It wasn't full. Huh. Builder, builder, builder. Gonna make you all builders. Where is the, where's the other guy? I need to make a builder. Oh, do we have... Is a spammer again? Oh, I didn't see it. My bad. Murray02. No, it's someone who is watching the stream. 
I, d I don't see them in the list though. Oh, they were kicked. Oh, that guy kicked them. You can ban the chat for new people. Oh, that's a good idea. Hang on. Uh, spectator, you can't chat. Haha. -ha. So, all these th people, I just made boulders. Are they actually builders or like are they actual people or are they just um alts of the other guy i cannot believe i was going to become a victim of id theft again it was probably not id theft it was probably just a random name that they decided to copy Okay, um, you know, if we, if we get spam, I know who'll have done it. So I'll make y'all boulders. Well, this is annoying. I suppose it comes with the territory of being a large YouTuber. And now 100k isn't necessarily that large, but it lar it's large enough that stuff like this can happen. And someone explain, explain this spamming thing. Well... We have someone who's being a little immature and they're spamming uh, offensive stuff and I don't have all the appropriate tools to be able to combat it nicely and we were trying some stuff and so far it seems to have somewhat helped it disabling the chat. Big streamer paints. Yeah, we have over 200 people, you know. I appreciate you all for watching. Apart from that one guy <laughs> who was spamming. But yeah, uh, by the way, if you join and I forget to give you like builder uh, permissions, just say in the chat. And I know you'll be in the chat because watching the stream is the only way you can get this password. Well, I do suppose these are some nice notes for the OpenRST2 development team that uh, it would be neat if I got some stronger tools. But once again, I, like I said, I don't know how feasible it is to develop those. It's definitely possible, but might not be feasible for them. You leaked it on your Discord. I didn't leak the password on my... Oh, the Vos Marshall thing. Yeah, but I changed it just now to Nijmegen CS and they joined again. So... They're definitely watching the stream because I didn't share that on my Discord server. Oh, hang on. I got a tip from Brox. If I make a network group... Without any uh, permissions. I mean, basically, that spectator at the moment. And give it to that guy. Yeah, that will work. But then he would need to be—he would need to join again. And I think it might have stopped him. Nijmegen. Yeah, I was just thinking of something random. And that was the first thing that popped into my mind from playing GeoGuessr. Okay, what do we have here? We have another transport ride. Which is this monorail. I think plugins can help you with IP bans. Weren't the plugin <laughs> that we need to be multiplayer safe plugins and auto kick on using bad language. Cause the plugins were the ones that caused the crashes at the start of the stream. Oh, the cheats. My bad. I need to re-enable all those. There we go. Okay. That's all the cheats. But yeah, if there's a plugin for that, that would be wonderful. 
I can't open or delete my rotor drop. Yeah, the deleting right was disabled. I'll enable that for now again. Um, hang on, where did I do that? No, not default. Uh, builder. And plugins can be multiplayer safe. Curious why it crashed on the ones you had though. Yeah, I'll send, after the stream, um, if you help me remember, I'll send all my plugins to you. And you might be able to see which one caused the problem. We have a nice little, well, little, it's not little. <laughs> we have a nice wooden coaster here. And it's not little at all. It's going like, what, 150-ish? The max, let's have a look. And... 138. Ah, I was close. I didn't think about a game mode where my friends could help to build and maintain coasters in the park. Yeah, it's really cool, the RCT multiplayer. And that's actually been a big selling point of OpenRCT2. Although I feel like it's a bit of an overrated selling point. You know, it's really cool, the multiplayer. But every a lot of people sell OpenRCT2 like it has multiplayer. But I also feel like most people aren't actually using the multiplayer. So... It's sold like it's a bigger deal than it is. I think all the quality of life improvements are a much bigger deal than multiplayer, personally. I like this coaster. It's not like very tall and doesn't go very fast, but it has a lot of elements and it looks realistic. So, uh, well done. And it's... Did you delete it yourself, whoever built that? Or is it that guy again who is deleting rights? You know, if you delete your own right, that's fine with me. Okay, well... Then, if you didn't delete it... No one can delete rights anymore. Looks like someone doesn't want us to have a nice evening. Let's see, what do we have here? Nice out and back wooden coaster. I know there are a couple of... ...different varieties on... Uh there are a couple of different, like, different manufacturers of wooden coaster. You have, like, a GCI or whatever. And there's one who does, like, lots of out and back and stuff. I don't know which is which. But this would be like a, some like you have like this would be one of the manufacturers. Someone would know that I wouldn't. We have a road here. Ooh, that's a big maze. That's kind of neat. Probably gonna take guests a long time. <laughs> There's even a Vacoma wooden coaster. Neat. You could probably create a new role for the people who are definitely aren't in the troll group as delete contacts. I could like Builder Pro. Yeah, you know, why not? Uh, add group. I said add group. Oh, whoops. Now we have two new. Gr uh, remove group. Rename group. Trust the builder. I'm not going to give this to everyone, but I'm going to give it to a few people that I know are trusted. That, you know, that I know the name of that I've known for a while. And if I don't pick you, that just means I don't know you. Oh, well, that guy's already at me. <laughs> He doesn't need to be a trusted builder. Uh, let's see. 
You have been in the chest, so you're fine. Cody. I haven't seen Cody in the chat, actually. I don't think this is Cody Watkins, so I'm gonna hold off on that for now. If it is you, let me know in the chat. Uh, Praetor, Hank, Alex, Orange, you guys are all fine. I know all of you. Keep in mind, whoever was trolling was stealing names of chat people. Were they? Hmm. Yeah, well, I mean, they did like the Murray number two, but didn't see them just straight up stealing actual names. No trusted builder. I made you a trusted builder. Did I not? Did I? I thought I did. Where are you? Oh, apparently I didn't. There we go. You've been on it, Robin Hood. Well, it no longer exists. Wait, this isn't Robin Hood. Oh, the Vacoma. Uh, do you mean the Vacoma wooden coaster? You forgot to set the pressure. Oh, of course I did. <laughs> you have literally no perms. Uh, <laughs> uh, let's see. Path, clear landscape. Uh, guest staff. No, not staff. Well, you know, why not? Uh, cheat. No, not cheat. Toggle scenery. Oh, that is a thing, apparently. I didn't... Modify tile. Is that all you need? I think that's all. So, you know, in my head... So, I know why this went wrong with me. In my head, I was like, this is going to be a copy of Builder. Um, and so, that's why I immediately... I, I thought it wasn't be a problem that I didn't immediately change the properties... Because I, in my head, it was already the same as Builder, and all I need to do was add one thing. Let's see, what does Builder have? Does it have any extras? Builder does have toggle scenery cluster. So whoever said like a while ago that they couldn't do that, you should be able to. Join us, Marcel. Become trusted immediately. <laughs> if there's another Marcel, then uh, I don't trust you. I'm Cody in multiplayer. Well. I think I can trust you. We had a Yars. Probably trust you. Murray Zero. You're fine. I mean, what's the worst that can happen? Someone can delete a few rights, which is annoying. But, you know. Cluster Senior is limited use and you are still limited to a few actions per second. Oh. And of course. Okay, it seems like we're done with all the madness. So, so I hope for we're going to have a better time now. Well, I thought this was going to be synced. I thought for a second that this was going into the second loop. But unfortunately, it's not quite synchronized. Interesting, if two rides of a similar exit entrance building are both being constructed, the game gets confused. Oh. Well, that's something to look into. How do I join the server? There's info at the top. Also, I think because I made the password longer, it's no longer <laughs> nicely in the middle. Let me see if I can... That's better. Let me open the right, it auto closes it again. Yeah, that sometimes happens. Makes sense, the game has quite some assumptions about the first element of a type on a tile being the one it needs. That didn't make all much sense to me, but I trust you that it makes sense. We have jet skis on. No, it's not jet skis, that's. Oh, it is jet skis. On a car ride. <laughs> 
Neat. Yeah, we are on development branch. Uh, we are... Are we still on that one? Or did they release a new version in the... in? Nope, that's been available since yesterday. That's still the correct version. Seems to be. Yep. Alright, let's look around. We have a station building for this one now. Is it me or does this roof tile... Is, it, is that a pirate roof tile? I think that might be from the pirate. Uh, do we have the pirate list that's any separate here? No, I don't think we do. So it must be then here? No, it's not. Where is it? It's what? It should be somewhere. Maybe it's just not here because it is already under walls. Pirates is. Oh, the entire pirate thing is in walls on the roof. Not the entire pirate thing. Then the ship should be somewhere here. Oh, yeah, I see it. There it is. We have a lot of pirate sheep. Also, lovely guests that are boarding a ride. I think... No, they're not board. Yeah, they are boarding a ride. They're like boarding here. Watch them, watch them disappear. He's already... According to the game, he's already on this ride. Right here. There he is. He just got there. At the exact moment, Slime disconnected. You need to update network version 2. That goes automatically if you get the new development version. Ooh, a launch freefall. I have a feeling like every time I see something new, I just say, ooh, something new. <laughs> My most used word in this live stream is ooh. It looks neat. Nice factory building. Well done. Ooh, <laughs> a stand-up coaster. The track is ever so subtly different from... Like a Vacoma or Aero Coaster, like a Corkscrew Coaster, Laydown Coaster. But I prefer it so much. I love the stand up coaster track. I think the Corkscrew Coaster track is ugly. It's so slightly different. But for me, for some reason, it makes all the difference. And I don't really know why. Good quote. Ooh, we almost have quote 420. I'll give you a quote 420. Smoke weed every day. There you go. Just like you made quote 69 nice. Nice bright green spinning wild mouse. I don't like the spinning wild mouse as a coaster type. You know why? It's basically the normal wild mouse, but it can't do steep tracks. Like the Virginia, or the, no, not the Virginia real. The, 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 the hairpin can do steel tracks. The normal wild mouse can do steep tracks. The wooden wild mouse can do steep tracks. But, uh, oh right, spectator is still the default. My apologies. But the spinning wild mouse can't. And I know it's got spinning and stuff, but, you know... Builder, builder. To me, it's, it's just, ugh. I just don't like it. It's just a steel Virginia reel. I mean, it is, but I like the Virginia reel. I don't like the steel wild mouse. I don't know why. I, who the hell made that right? Did I make the bad guy a builder again? I was about to rename it. <laughs> At least it's not as offensive as some of the earlier names. <laughs> but it's still not very nice. Also, this queue line bug has been in the game for like forever. When you build a ride with a pre-built queue line, obviously this is meant to go like that. 
But it didn't go like that. It went like this. You know, I'll, I'll properly rebuild it as it was. It was like that. And maybe the guy did it himself, whoever built this. But I know this is a pre-built ride. Um, and that coaster has been... That bug has been in the game for so long. That sometimes the queue line messes up when you build it automatically. I believe one of the queue lines in my... River Rapids overview, where I had them in Bumbly Bazaar, also had that in that shot. So you're welcome to check. Um, but, uh, you know, there's no reason to. Who just deleted that? Who did that? Uh Oh. I mean, this has still been a successful stream. We've had a lot of uh, fun stuff built, so. Nowadays, we have coasts like Time Twister, a spinning launched inverting coaster. That's interesting. Trolls get bonked. Yeah, but, you know, this guy isn't stupid. He is... Joining under fairly normal names, not spamming the chat, and just randomly deleting small stuff. So they're not stupid. That's... Why is the game frozen? That was just the lag spike. Search for delete in log. Yeah, but people are deleting stuff all the time. Like, if I go to the bottom, um, is there, if I go to remove, is remove scenery a thing? No. Yeah, I can't see it here. Like I said, I can maybe investigate that. Scenery remove action. Scenery remove action. And then let's go up so that I get the latest. Okay, that is presumably the latest then. And that was made by Shadow. Well. No, that's not the old file. Or clear action. Let's see if I can find clear action then. Um. Oh, this, yeah, this is the, this is the stuff. A lot of clearing. Benji. I think the name is. Let's see if we can find a player called Benji. Uh... No. Or am I just reading over it? Oh, he has disconnected. I mean, he is watching the stream. Like I said, he's not dumb. There's nothing I can do about it. May I have the password? Look at the top of the screen. Now, if he joins under a different name... Oh, let's see. Minor bug and rat salad. If you're in the chat... Oh, I keep doing hype. That's for the console. Ask for... Uh, permissions.
Can I get building rights? Yes, you can. Could you require people to speak in Twitch chat for perms? Yeah, that's what I just... Like, red salad... Kangi. Oh, you do not have permission. Well, you're a trusted builder. Do we have any other spectators? No. Can I sort my group? Uh, I can click on it, but it doesn't do anything. Exactly 2.81 laterals. That's unfortunate. What about mods that only give permissions passwords to followers of a certain time f time frame? I mean, you know, the problem is then I would have to like do all setup around it, which is possible, but not for this one anymore. I would need to do that in advance. It lists in join order. Yeah, but that was like gonna see if pressing on these buttons that that does nothing. And so far, I hadn't needed anything like this to do a setup and stuff. Um, but now I apparently do. Ha, huh, we have Jesus Christ. This is not the first one. This has been a joke in one of my parks. I've also, I, I've made a super Jesus once who didn't walk on water. And well, he walked on space or the void. It wasn't actually the void. It was just granted that looked like the void, but... He was super Jesus. And he was magnificent. Let me tell you that. Like, of course he was. He was super Jesus. Super Jesus is always magnificent. I like the, the colors of this. Only this vertical drop coaster should be a little bit brighter green. May I have permissions? You may. Right ownership in multiplayer would be really dope. Yes, like an option. I don't. Once again, I don't know how feasible this is, but I know Brox is listening, so he will. Uh, at least one of the developers will hear this. An option that for me to enable, like only people can delete whatever they've built. Once again, that's probably not feasible. Oh, there we go again. Uh. Shall I? You know what? I'll just keep him. He can't chat. He is a spectator. He can't do anything. So. You know. There you go. It already exists as a plugin. Can I have permissions? You can. And now we're gonna do that, aren't we? I mean, if there's anything I can't do anything about. Wait, this is some. Well, that's not the same guy. Um, you can have permissions. This is. The only way I could do anything about this is like do beforehand that I would vet this and like have a white list and not have the password public but yeah there's nothing I can do about this unfortunately so my apologies we do have a nice twister coaster here Is there no void terrain enabled? Uh, no, apparently not. Huh. Oh look, it's a Dutch guy as well. It's just part of multiplayer. Yeah, but it's, it's not as simple as that, cause you know, I'm someone with an audience. I have to take care of that. I have to, you know, be responsible of that. Yeah, next time we could think up a plan beforehand. Or I might just not do this again. Anyway, what else is new? 
Twitch is weird and can punish streamers for stuff like this. Well, this has nothing to do with Twitch. Like... Like, uh, I don't know what Twitch would have have to do with this. This is a nice giga coaster. Can non-host check the logs? No, it's a file on my computer. You have Twitch subs only channel. But then only the Twitch subs can build, and that's a thing I don't like, you know? So... The, you know, the problem with this, I can easily... I can easily make this, like, you know, I obvious... I can easily, like, vet it beforehand, only have, like, people I know and trust join. But the fun thing is that anyone can join. Anyone can have fun. You know, it's a community thing. Like, if I only have Brox and other people I know and trust for a while, and, you know, trusted chatters and people who pay, like, that's still fun, but it's, it's, not, it's not the same. Meanwhile, I built the rat castle. Where is a castle? I don't see a castle. Hmm. Nope. I do see this. Oh, that's neat. More near the entrance. Is it... Is this supposed to be a castle? No, it's more like a garden. It is nothing but spam, it's crashing. Wait a minute. Which one? It was the blue one. Where is it? There are, this is such a big map. It's very hard to find things. Looks like someone has a plug and able to automatically places benches and bins for new parts. Huh. That's a neat plugin. That's slightly different than the bench warmer I have. I don't have it enabled now, of course, because I got rid of all plugins. Search for Castle Enterprise. You know, I'll actually start looking for it. Oh, there it is. Presumably. Huh, this is neat. A lot of cannons. Oh, whoops. Ah, oh, it looks rather nice. Uh, it... Runs on whatever that's running on. Yeah, latest development build. Let's see. I like that some of these original rides are still there. Like this go kart. Which has had only 113 guests. Oh, it's stuck. Why is it stuck? Okay, that one keeps on crashing. It is being built on, though. But please crash your single rail coaster less, whoever's building it. I'm done building too much bugginess and griefing going on. Yeah. Alright, see ya, Pietro Lima. I just figured you're probably from Lima. Uh, in Peru. And called Pietro. Which seems like a feasible name. Feasible Spanish name. Well, it was a pleasure having you here. Oh, this, this area has had some development. I like the dedication to the pink trees. 
with you know the pink you have the pink trees you have the th like different kind of pinks and purples uh dodgems and all that stuff we have a pink and purple uh twister well hyper twister coaster pinks and purples sounds like a band name oh these areas are now connected. That's cool. With the train, it reminds me a bit of the fruit farm scenario. Ah, and these coasters are back. Nice. I like this. Hey, these were flower beds. Now they're replaced by pink trees. What else do we got? We got a lot of... Wow, that's a graveyard. That's a candy hell. And that's watery hell. Well, not for everyone. Katara would feel right at home there. And... I know this would be like a Zuko's mood. And this would be... Tai Lee, obviously. They are connected. That road is possible. That's bitrate sla slaughter. Oh, this. Yeah, I can see that. <laughs> if I move around. <laughs> does it kill all the bits? It's a dev build. Yeah, it's the latest dev build that you need. Developer build. It's the one that I linked earlier with the multiplayer build that you need. We got a partial coaster here with wooden coaster trains. It looks a bit weird because of the things we're used to. But they do fit quite well on it. So it doesn't look too bad. Obviously it looks a bit bad in the inversions because it doesn't have all the sprites for it. But you know, other than that... Looks fine. Like, yeah, here it just randomly switches. To, well, not randomly, but suddenly switches to other sprites because it misses some in between. Is Marshall going to build anything? I already have, actually. Oh, hey, this ride's back. Well done. Day. I built this thing. Obviously. Because it's the best. Oh, look at that. Uh, and... Bam. Oh, there we go. It's now a blocked term. Good. I also built this panda ride. <laughs> and someone added, the pandas are coming. How is that word not just auto banned by Twitch itself? I don't know. I, I, I don't have an auto ban my... I, I don't have a list of banned words myself. I do in my YouTube comment section. Like, those kinds of terrible words are just banned in my comment section. Because there's no reason for anyone to ever use them. But I never thought to do it for Twitch, but I will now. I don't know if Twitch offers that functionality. I hope they do. Otherwise, Nightbot probably does. The Void. I thought this was a Y. But it was a V that wasn't quite finished. It's not quite the Void, but... Uh, the blackness is close enough. Yeah, it reminds me of my soul. Sorry for my slow reaction. Lots of lag here. Mobile interface isn't great. Like, I hate the interface. And I'm on my computer. Like, if I click on the name... Then... I don't know. I don't find it easy to do. I don't like the Twitch interface. I, it's only a few buttons, but... I still don't like it. For some reason. Twitch does. Good. Good. 
But you know, I can deal with someone spamming in the Twitch chat because we can just ban them and I need to make an all new account. That's all fine. It's not fine, but you know, that's not that much of a problem. The problem is in this multiplayer stuff where I don't have the tools to efficiently ban them. Now you need the latest development build, Fire Eyes. Like, you are definitely using the wrong build because no one else is having a problem so there's something wrong on your end okay this thing has been completed for a while because it hasn't been changed i do like the queue line with you know that changes like checkerboard pattern i don't i don't think the colors really work well together but i like the idea the problem is mostly that they can just reconnect and change their name to get new default perms again. Well, the problem is also that they can just reconnect because there's a join message like that name joined. And they can just like be offensive with just their name. And it's like there are no accounts in OpenRCT2. So I can't, I, you can't ban people, you can only kick people. I would love to have the Void Terrain for Void. Yeah, that's my bad. I forgot to add it. Uh, but, you know, we'll be fine without it for once. Yeah, the 041.3 is just some weird internal name. That's the network version. Like, if you're on the latest... If you're on the latest development build, you should just be able to see the server in the list. And, like, the name is obvious, with Marshall Multiplayer. Okay, what else is new? Well, there was a go-kart here at some point. Huh, I was under the impression that these pirate ships were, like, 90 degrees turned in respect to the rest of the park. Huh. My orientation, like, my feeling of direction was a bit off, apparently, when I built those. We have... No, we've already seen this. Have we seen that? That's a neat little garden. Lots of iced tea shops. Don't know why you'd need that many. Uh, we've already seen that. I mean, there's a heart line here. I think this was here at some point, but then got deleted, maybe due to some bugs, because that was... Like, I got bugged here a bit, even though I wasn't building it. And this wooden coaster is new. Or is this... No, it's not just Colossus or Rolling Thunder. I knew, I kind of knew it wasn't, but they look somewhat similar. In part due to the color schemes. Oh, this is wonderful. Whoever built this, this is wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. Well done. That last update was yesterday. Yesterday, yeah, that's the one you need. That's the latest development version. I like the color scheme on this one as well. This is a default. This is one, a color scheme that I've kind of don't like. Pew. Partly because it's one of the... It's because I overused it. I started to dislike it. Alright, see ya, Brox. Thanks for uh, participating and helping out with a little bit here and there. Um, I started to dislike this color scheme because I overused it. And it's one of the default color schemes for the inverted coaster. But now I haven't used it in such a long while that it's suddenly like... Yeah, no way, that is neat. I'm no longer overexposed to it, so I like it again. Really loving all these builds. So much creativity. Yes. Ooh, this has changed to uh, bricks now. Uh, still looks nice. And we have some giant snails. Cool. I mean, a pyramid tower like that requires ultimate creativity. <laughs> yeah, but these gardens are nice. Was the, you know, that castle. Oh, this void. But, you know, the tentacles. It's nice. 
now we have, you know, this mountain somewhere here. There we go. That's neat. Jesus. Jesus, save us all. A nice diagonal ride, which looks really funny from this angle. Like, it looks great from these two angles, but from these two angles, it looks just bad. It's just because of the way the game looks. We have this... This is just messing around with weird, like, ride vehicle configurations, which is always fun. Oh, that was a little bit of a lag spike. This has gotten some upgrades. With the uh, industrial theming and the go-karts. But yeah, back to this, Legos, you said you built it. So yeah, the way this looks bad is not because you built it badly, it's just because diagonal tracks, if you look them head on, they just look a bit weird in the game. And if you have like a little bit, it's fine. But if you have a lot of it, it just looks a bit bad. <laughs> like, you can see with the density of the crossbars that they're going up or down when the density of the crossbars changes, but you can't exactly see it and it just looks weird. Is there a Marcel Voss character walking around? Uh, we have Bench Boy and Bench Girl. They were recreated. Carrie asked for that at the very start of the stream. And uh, they have been recreated. For some reason, spectators can't chat. Well, that was for a very good reason. But I'll give you building permissions. Uh, let's see. Fire Ice. There you go. Why is your name colored? Was that your choice or is that anything else? Huh. Yeah, spectators can't chat because we had a... Sp Why is your name color? I don't know. I, I, I didn't know names could have a color. Other than black, which is technically not a color, I suppose. Huh. That's interesting. It's a shame Prox is left, because he probably would have known about the feature of colors. You know this bracket? What do you mean? The void checkerboard is trippy. It has changed. Oh, because there's a checkerboard on it. Doing this allows you to... Oh, now the chat is red? Huh. I didn't know that. That's neat. I've never seen that before. Also, poor ping for Floki. Are you Australian? Hey, who made... How did you make it green? Is that with different brackets? Oh, it's the same, and you just say green and red. Huh. I didn't know that. For purple, you do pill lavender. Cool. That's neat. Name a character Jesus and put him into water. That's literally already been done. <laughs> and also mechanic 74. Uh, also, obviously, this is an actual... Like, there is water here, but there's an invisible path. So he's not actually walking on water. Thank you for the six months, uh, Dark Kitty. And thank you for the eight months, Vu Le Trois. Five minutes ago. Sorry, I missed that. Oh, and thank you for the th uh, three months, Theo RW. Three minutes ago. Um, sorry for missing that. And also the other stuff. I presume it was because it happened during... You know, let's just call it the, the, the panics. As a reference to the troubles. Uh, so, any other stuff that I missed? You know, all the follows we got in that time. Welcome. Thank you. And I'll drink some water. And I'll drown someone from 51 minutes ago.
All right. Drown anyone. I'll drown guest 4425. You are the unlucky guy. Okay, you know what I've been really getting into recently? Um, and I'm really behind on this. Because this channel recently hit 100 million subscribers. And some of you might already know it. It's Mr. Beast. And obviously I knew of his existence for a long time. Because I don't live under a rock in terms of YouTube. Alright, see ya Max. But recently I've been really like getting into his videos. I wasn't into his videos before. But I've been watching a lot of them that I hadn't watched yet. And also I watched some podcasts with him. Just to see some behind the scenes. And he's talking about it. And it's wonderful. Drown Bench Boy. It means we're gonna, we're gonna need a new Bench Boy then. I wanna go home. You can go home to hell. Oh, there's a mechanic there as well. Bench Dad. Nice. That's also a reference. Weird tangent after drowning a guy. I don't know why, but it suddenly popped into my head. Let's make a new Bench Boy. There you go. Yeah, I wonder what you guys' opinion on Mr. Beast is. Do you like his channel? Do you... Don't dislike his channel, his videos, for any particular reason? Wasn't his bench guy... Oh, it's the old bench guy, yeah, not bench boy. Bench boy has the alliteration there. The bench guy, yeah. Never seen any of his videos. I think they're really good. Like, the Mr. Beast Reacts channel is a bit, little bit less in my wheelhouse. But I do think Mr. Beast is the best YouTuber in the world at the moment. Not necessarily that he makes the best videos for everyone. Like, some people just don't like his content. Because, like, some, you know, not, not all content is made for everyone. But... Um... I think he is the best YouTuber in the term of he understands YouTube really well. He knows how to do retention. He just has like an exceptional passion for it. I, I just, yeah, I think he is the best YouTuber in the world at the moment. He just hit 100 million subs. I mean, you don't hit that with nothing. Um, and... You know, he's going to be the biggest internet star in the world at some point. He's already not that far away. React videos are cancer. It's not that his react videos are cancer. I think they're decent because he does actually add stuff. He's not just sitting there and smiling and doing nothing. But it's just not my style necessarily. Some of them are, but some of them aren't. Same with the gaming videos. A bit hit or miss for me. Let's do not passing station. You know what, this won't actually have terrible stats. Oh, there are 12 trains. Let's not do that. I know he gives a lot of money to charity, which is good, but I can't stand him. He's just the most current year Zoomer YouTube soyism. What the hell is that? Appears to be Zoomer. It's just not a YouTube corporate drone. What do you mean YouTube corporate drone? He's worked his way up from the bottom. Like, is is not made by YouTube. You can still see see his earliest videos. Um, I should actually connect this to the path. <laughs> like, I just almost forgot both the exit and the entry line. Like, he started making Minecraft videos when he was thirteen. And yeah, just because he's popular doesn't mean he's bad. Mr. Beast just kind of falls under the category big channel, therefore it's turning to shit on. Yeah, a little bit. Although he doesn't get, at least in the circles I live in, not that much shit. Uh, as far as I know. Like, I'm part of a partnered YouTube Discord server, which is only for partnered YouTubers. So you need to at least have a thousand subs and four thousand watch hours in the last year. And you make money with your channel. And everyone there just respects him. Then again, 
everyone there is a YouTuber, so it, it is like a, a bubble. But like, I have mad respect for him for how he does it. And I've been watching podcasts with him, and it's really interesting to to see the behind the scenes and you know behind the man it's just it's crazy what he's done and what he's able to do and every time i watch like a main channel video of his like the last one giving my 100 million subscriber an island he just he keeps my retention all the way through and obviously he's a master at retention and i could probably learn from that although obviously I don't want to emulate his style entirely because my style is just different. I'm not as energetic as him. And that's on purpose. I'm not going to scream. But yeah, he is a master at that. And there are certain elements of his videos. Oh, look, I can't open it. Bug. There are certain elements of his videos that I could learn from. Which I've already learned from, probably. Thank you for the two months, Simpy Matt. Gonna go for a bit, maybe see you later. I don't know, but see us, line. I don't know if I'll still be alive. He's a master clickbaiter. Yeah, but also, like, it's clickbait, but it's not too clickbait. Got a tiny complaint about lag. Yeah, we know you have a complaint about lag. You know? It's not suddenly gonna go away. Like, yeah, sometimes I see Mr. Beast titles and then see the video and I'm like... Uh, yeah, that's a bit on the clickbaity side, but it's not terrible clickbait. So, it's a little bit further than I would go personally. But I, I'm still like, yeah, it's still okay. It's the, it, it, it's on the edge of the good kind of clickbait, is what I would say. Eight days into the new job and I got a bonus. Well, looks like I got a bonus too. Thank you, Voodoo. And I'm happy you got your race. Oh, I can't... Can I build path under there at all? I don't think I can, so I wouldn't be able to connect that. Let's build it somewhere where I can connect it. Oh, thank you for the 69 <laughs> bits, obviously. Just 489 isn't good. It, it's got to be... 420 and 69. Two separate ones. YouTube should be for random dudes making weird videos on niche things. YouTube shouldn't be a job. You do realize that YouTube is my job, right? Like, I spend like 35, 40 hours a week on YouTube. And in fact, in the past week, I've probably spent like 60 hours on YouTube. <laughs> This is, I'm full. I'm a full-time YouTuber. I wouldn't be able to be a random, like a dude who makes random videos on niche things if I didn't make money from it. I would still be able to make videos, but not nearly as many. And especially if, like, if I also, for example, um, had a girlfriend or even kids and a job other than YouTube, then I wouldn't be able to spend, like any time well not any time you do still have free time for hobbies but then i would maybe have like five or six hours a week to spend on it combined with also my other hobbies mr beast is great yes he is and why should youtube only be a job like you have your people who make niche videos and random stuff in their spare time yes plenty Ooh, this got some new scenery. Sweet. And you still have those people. But there are also lots of people who do it for a job and make stunning videos. Like most creators I would do it for a job and make... Ooh, Dirk Link. Welcome. Uh, do I need to make him a trusted builder? Or is he already a builder? He's a spectator. There we go. Trusted builder. Hey everyone, welcome. Hey everyone, and welcome to another multiplayer video. <laughs> How accurate was that? I mean, obviously I don't have his voice. <laughs> I tried my best. 
The real debate is realizing the people that don't do clickbait are also doing it to cater to an audience. Yeah, you know the old anti-clickbait? Like Adam Neely is famous for it, but I also have done it a few times with the, you know, the handyman mowing lawns videos. Stuff like that. Um, like, I do the anti-clickbait to get you to click. It's not like I do it just for, just to, for integrity. It's partly, but also just because I think more people will click it. And all my thumbnails and titles are made with the intention of people to click it. I mean, some of the other thumbnails are terrible. And I need to update them at some point. But they are made, you know, for you to click them. It's only annoying if creators rub it in your face all the time. It's their job. I mean, if their livelihood depends on it, I sort of, de uh, you know. I, I, sort of, I, I understand what you mean, but I understand it. Okay, do we have any other stuff here? Well, lots of new rides got built here. This reminds me so much of the other deserty bits that got built in my previous multiplayer streams. And I don't know, I don't, no one has claimed it is, but I have a feeling it's the same person every time. It probably isn't, it's probably multiple people building here, but... I have a feeling it's just one person doing the same thing every time. Clickbait thoughts are okay, the videos are actually good. Well... Once again, like we've discussed on the previous vi uh, live stream, like this really the last live stream, I believe. It's like, there are two types of clickbait. Veritasium has a great video on it. There's the clickbait, that's the clickbait that I do, which, sen which you know, takes the most sensational bit of a video. Um, you know, like, the, it took me 400 hours to beat this scenario. That's going to be Thursday's video. That's sensational. That's clickbait. But... It's also true. So that's not that's type 1 clickbait or legit bait as Veritasium calls it. How to get building permissions again? I'll give you building permissions. Um but there's also the bad clickbait which would would be like for example if you you know you do a vlog you have a and you accidentally like no, no, drive into a pole in, in like a bollard or whatever. And you title it like, I almost died! Or, you know, some kind of, uh, you know, s a title that implied that your, I don't know, your partner cheated on you, but in fact, nothing happened. You know, stuff like that. That's bad clickbait. So, you know, there's a difference between that. Okay, what else is new? There's this coaster, which is neat. Looks more realistic than your standard coaster that I built. There's this element, which I like, and I use it myself as well sometimes. Um, I believe it's also an element on the Goliath, like the, the, the orange one, or something like this. And it's really neat. It's like you go steep and then you... Make the, it's sort of like a top, like an inverted top hat, but on its side, if you know what I mean. And I quite like it. Well, not entirely on its side, of course, but slanted a bit. Oh, hey, these are the rides from Three Monkey Spark. See no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil. Someone saved them and rebuilt them. Neat. And we have another transport ride here. I wonder which ride has had the most uh, people ride it. Is this giving a lot of lag? Yeah, I should probably close that, but it's lift one. That gave a lot of lag. Is this right? No, that's high dive by slime. Oh, I... I should go to lift one. Hang on, I quickly want to find it. Okay, got it. 
More lag detected. Could you can you please stop complaining about lag? We know there's lag. This is lift one, and apparently it has had the most guests out of any ride in the park. And that's a crash. Hello Marcia, good evening from the Netherlands. Well thank you, Rianne. Good evening to you as well. I'm not trying to tempt fate here, but is there a way to make a lag coaster? Like a coaster that can lag the game until the server crashes. Um, I wouldn't know how, to be honest. Is this thing closed? Let's see if I can open it. Oh, and we have a crash. I mean, you can do certain things that if you zoom out and you have OpenGL, it lags your game. Which I've actually... I've actually crashed the game, which... Made too much lag like that at some point. That was years ago. I'm not sure if that was still working newer versions though. That's a long train. How many cars is that? Like 150? 145? Ah, I was quite close on the estimate. Only uh, about 3% off. Ooh, that's uh, a hybrid coaster. And quite a scary one. Come on, can I click on it? There we go. 3.27 Gs. We don't have an intensity rating yet. But I promise you, it will be high. Quite high. A vertical chain lift. That exists in real life. I'm not sure if it exists on a hybrid coaster in real life. But yeah, vertical chain lifts are absolutely a thing in real life. So that's fine. Alright, see ya, Darkling. Um, has this developed anything more? We have a second rail line in here. Which is neat. I'd like a supervillain to rise in these streams who wrecks havoc by subtly changing tiles, modifying them as a car, making toilets expensive. Like, it would definitely be possible to do, like, a storyline iron that, like, a scripted, like, ish storyline. But not, I, I wouldn't be bothered with doing that. Let's see. This thing is still in the construction. This is new. Reminds me a bit of, I mean, it's just a color scheme, a bit of Quantum Thruster. Is it Quantum Thruster, the pre-build? Is it called that? Uh, yes, it is. I mean, like I said, it's just a color scheme that reminds me of it. Otherwise, it's not really all that similar. My buddies, my building buddies, absconded. I've never heard that word before. I spent the past half hour on the dual wooden coaster. There's a lot. This has extended. Ah, this is compressed into a single car. <laughs> Lol. Okay, what else? Oh, I saw that. <laughs> we have a punish and punishing area. It's flower beds of fire, just a toilet, hot dogs and fizzy drinks. Oh, I had to drink some water ten minutes ago. Well, I'll do that now. Apparently, in these multiplayer streams, I'm not at all focused on the activity feed. I mean, I had an excuse for uh, part of it, but right now I don't have an excuse for that. Purgatory, yes, that's that's a, that's the word I was looking for. It lacks a cash machine. I mean, we have it available, right? I can add the cash machine there. There you go. Now it's more symmetrical as well. But at, at some point they'll want to go home and they won't buy anything. You know, a lot of people, they have this thing like, you know, trap gas somewhere and they'll have to take the next ride. You know, if you chain rides with exits to entrances and stuff, they'll have to take the next ride or they'll have to keep buying drinks. Or people think like, I'll make my toilets 10 bucks and make free drinks. So they'll pay 10 bucks for the toilets. And I'm like, 
that's just not how the game works. If guests want to go home, they won't ride any ride, unless it's a free transport ride. If guests want to go home, they won't buy a drink. If toilets are more than 60 cents, guests will never ever pay it. That's just how the game works. Thank you for the follow, Gooba Wooba and Watch Scoops. You know, even the official RCT Twitter tweeted like a while ago that something like that, a meme with like paying five bucks or ten bucks for the toilet. This is a nice coaster, by the way. Also a more realistic layout. We have block breaks here. We have a break here. I think that wouldn't be a block break. It's rather neat. So, uh, well done, that guy. And suddenly I'm building on a bobsled that I didn't do. And we have a... Oh, I thought it was a guest, but it's an entertainer. I was like... And we have a guest here. Wait, the guest is taking their hat off? What? But, nope. Someone deleted track beats. Yeah, if you... That can happen. Like, if you're randomly building on a coaster and you were already building a coaster... You know, weird stuff might happen. Uh, you know, it happens. And we have a dino monorail here. What are you trying to do, Cringe? There's no multiplayer command. What are the stats actually on this? Not long enough, right? No, it gets a length penalty. Uh, don't grieve, Fire Eyes. I mean, you can't destroy your ride because you're not a trusted builder anyway. So, I mean, I suppose you could edit the ride and destroy it that way. Oh, force build mode into it. Oh. Sorry. I thought you were going to grieve. Uh, I hope you understand why I thought that. Anyway. Hopefully I can finish my ride before the stream ends or the universe imploded. Well, I wasn't planning on continuing the stream for that long. Um, so you'll probably have maybe five or ten minutes. Oh, we have a new wooden coaster here. Wood chip, wood chip. Interesting name. Wait a minute. Is this the coaster from Crumbly Woods? It reminds me of that. Is it? Or from like carts and coasters, mate? No, Crumbly Woods has the dueling one. Yes, I recognize that name and layout. Yes. Neat. This is also a nice coaster. Just a big old twister coaster with launch lift hill. You are not forced to demolish the bobsleigh fire eyes. Where's the bobsleigh anyway? Did you just destroy the bobsleigh? Anyway. Yeah, I think it's time to... Uh, I was forced to build mode into it multiple times. Yeah, but then you, you can just click out of it. You don't have to destroy it. Okay, what's going on here? Something reels. Snareels. Oh, snails. <laughs> for, some, for some reason, I thought, like, this one was an R. <laughs> I was like, snareels. 
Oh, there's a lot of snails here. And a queue line without a group without without a button. I like the rainbow snails. You can see how the animation works. It's like going across in a diagonal. Let's see them move. Yeah, it's going across in a diagonal and they don't move at the same time because that would be like they're moving slightly different times. Is a hybrid coaster 3 too inventive because of inversions, drops, or both? Well, let me quickly go to hybrid coaster 3. Uh, there we go. We don't have the intensity. Um, so, I don't know. It has 17 drops and 8 inversions. Well, I can tell you that it will be too intense. Well... Probably, maybe not, but likely. You know, high top speed, high highest drop height. So, eight inversions is a lot. Like, anything more than... Like, more than five is already quite a lot. And 17 drops is also a lot. So, yeah, this will probably have a high intensity rating. It has a cool track style. It really does. X7 did a great job on it. Alright, thank you for building Murray Zero. I appreciate you uh, taking part. But yeah, I think that's enough. So, I want to thank everyone for taking part. And for building and for putting up with the spam. You know, I would apologize, but uh, I also had to put up with it, and it's not my fault, so uh, I'm not going to. It's just an unfortunate situation, and I thank you for putting up with it. Ooh, neat little coaster. It's a nice kiffa loop with turns. Will we revisit the server once one day again? Well, not this server. But yeah, I'm going to save the game. Well, the timestamp is no longer accurate. I'm going to quit. Reload the game. So we can have this as nice end, nice end screen. But this time I don't have to worry about causing lag or whatever. If I zoom out. This looks magnificent. Oh, that's a crash. Like here we can see really well what's all been built. A lot has been built. Haha. <laughs> Wiener. I like this. Thank you very much for building. Hopefully next time there's less griefing to deal with. Yeah, hopefully. So, but, you know, at some point we got a decent solution. Just making everyone a spectator. And, it, you know, a spectator not being able to chat. That was the solution that made it a little bit better. By the way, because of my 1440p screen, this is... Scaling factor one for me in all my recent videos. I've been using scaling factor one and a half Which means that all the buttons are slightly larger than they were on with scaling factor one on uh, 1080p But otherwise it's just too small this is one and a half is my standard now and because OpenGL I think feel like it has improved lately But one and a half used to look a bit ugly Um and I would only use the whole numbers, but recently it looks really well. It looks really nice. With if you use OpenGL. If you use software, it's not as nice. If you use OpenGL, it's really nice. And I've been using lots of different scaling factors in my videos recently. You know, I might go to two, three is one I frequently use. And never like I always have these buttons off, but three is one I might use, for example, when I have you know, if I follow a guest around and I have his screen at the top left, then three is a nice scaling factor. You know, stuff like that. And then I'm on two again, and we're on one and a half. Sometimes I use one, never with these buttons. But if I, you know, just want to get a larger shot, you know, because this is standard zoom. 
this is like normal zoom and this is twice zoomed in. But this is when I can get like, like nice sweeping shots of bars and stuff. Anyway, thank you very much. I like this end shot. Uh, for putting up with the, the spam, for building in the stream, for watching the stream. Because I know most of you haven't actually built, most of you just watched. And I appreciate that very much. So thank you all, and let's see if I can find someone to raise. Okay, no one who I follow stream roller coaster Tekken. Okay. Tekken twins. They're a VTuber who are playing roller coaster tycoon. Two. They have open, so they at least know a little bit about it. Alright. Thank you. Uh, have fun at the raid. And I'll see you tomorrow on the YouTubes, or otherwise wetness day, on the stream. See ya. Bye bye. Good night. <laughs>